Welcome to another edition of emag2411 on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. This is Eddie McMurray right here. Uh, with your WWE Raw, uh, March 23rd, 2017 full star preview. Now, don't forget, this is the final Raw before WrestleMania 31. We're six days away, less than a week. It's Sunday night, March the freaking 29th. Let's get into it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's not waste any time, sure. Five point preview. So, yeah. Now, it's been a typical road uh, to WrestleMania for Roman Reigns. Uh, but this week, he gets the greatest speed bump yet when he goes face to face with the current I am defending undisputed WWE World Heavyweight Champion Brock Lesnar will be the current of the pain before uh, battling the big dog on the grandest stage of them all now as rap icon Snoop Dogg and ESPN personality Bill Simmons prepares to join the WWE Universe less than one week before Wrestlemania 31 <clears throat> what else is in store on the final Robbie for the show of shows now WWE.com has some ideas now will Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar brawl before Wrestlemania now we're one week after Roman Reigns uh, moment momentarily uh, silenced Brock Lesnar's uh, verbose for, for advocate Paul Hammond, the big dog, will find himself within the mauling uh, distance of the Revenant's WWE World Champion. Now, just six days before looking, locking horns to WrestleMania, will the face face contradiction between Reigns and the Priest and Carnage end in brutality? If so, for whom? Now, will Howell's Triple H respond to Sting? Now, last Monday night, Seth Rollins attempted to orchestrate a plot to enslave Randy Orton. Sting mysteriously appeared to the Viper, lay waste to Mr. M Mr. Money in the Bank and his authority associates. Now, Sting's project team up. With the WWE's uh, Apex Predator sending a powerful message of defiance to his uh, WrestleMania opponent, Triple H, who was visibly shaken by the sudden emergence of the baseball bat, bat touting Enigma. Now, Sting will. Now, we all know that Sting would go on to address the WWE, WWE Universe after Raw went off the air on the, exclusively, though, as an interview on the WWE Network. Now, reiterating that he's ready to take the game down on. The grandest stage of them all. How will Triple H address his face planted foe this Monday night? Now, th does Retribution await bad news? Barrett fed up with the game of hot potatoes. Several superstars have been playing with the Intercontinental Championship in recent weeks. Bad news Barrett laid out at both uh, Dolce Lear and Dan Bryan on SmackDown this past Thursday night, re re uh, holding his reclaimed title high above two of the battered WrestleMania opponents. Even though the night ended less than favor favorably for Ziggler and Bryan, after their incredible efforts in the uh, night's uh, Intercontinental Contenders Dolan match, the yes man on the show offs never stay down for long. Will one or both of these wizards get some payback against the Intercontinental Champion on Raw tonight? Will Randy Orton get his hands on Seth Rollins? Now, Randy Orton's not the most patient superstar on the roster, and we seriously doubt he's going to wait until WrestleMania to get a hold of Seth Rollins again. Although several other members of the Authority suffered the Vipers Raptors and Smith on Lizard Money in the Bank and evaded on our queue. However, as history has taught us, WWE's Apex Center doesn't let his prey run for long. Will the Vipers sink his fangs into the future of the WWE on Raw? Now, is Rusev afraid of John Cena? The United States Champion Rusev is many, is many things. He's cunning, he's powerful, he's intimidating, and most importantly, he's unbeaten. But is he also getting nervous? Last Monday on Raw, in the final moments of the bizarre contract signing with his WrestleMania opponent, John Cena, the super athlete flipped a table onto the Cena Nation leader and made a quick escape up to the ramp. If, truly, if Rusev is truly as simple as he claims to be, why doesn't he just stand there and fight? Does he know that his US title reign is nearing its end? Is it the reality that he's about to suffer his first feet on the grand issues of the mall, no less, but it's too stinking, or is Rusev simply toying with Cena before, crush, before crushing him again at the show of shows? Now, expect some furious, some serious fireworks between Cena and Rusev before their anticipated WrestleMania match. You can tune in to Raw at 8th Town Central on the USA Network. Don't miss the Raw pre-show. Subscribe to the WWE Network and sign up at WWE.com at 6, 6.30, only on the WWE Network. And, yeah, um, so, this is the final show. We all know before WrestleMania 31. It's a stable center in Los Angeles, and they're going to take a few matches if you don't know for this week's uh Tonight, as there are no uh, Tuesday night tapings due to WrestleMania week. Now, confirmed, we already know it's a face-off between Brock Lesnar and Roman Reigns. Um, and as well as Triple H's response to Sting's action from last week. Now, don't also expect for Tank Draw is the final uh, 2015 Hall of Fame announcement and the last addition to the WrestleMania card. Celebrities are, now, uh, are also confirmed for tonight. Uh, as rapper soon that will be hosting and possibly doing an angle with Curtis Axel while ESPN and Gratland's Bill Simmons will be will be uh, guest commentating a few matches and likely will be doing an angle an angle with JBL now. Other stars are advertised for tonight include John Cena, Seth Rollins, Dean Ambrose, Kane, Randy Orton, Bray Wyatt, Big Show, and Dan Ryan. Now, PW Insider reports that Sting is in Los Angeles and skilled for all, but he's still not no, but it's still not known if the Undertaker will be appearing live in the finals will be for WrestleMania. 
you know, we all know what Dodie is focusing on the final winning points for tonight's goal. Home run. The five questions. So, yeah. That's the part about it. Hopefully, I mean, you know. You know how it goes. Oh, yeah, by the way. Now, WWE officials are reportedly discussing Barry Ogla Jr.'s strategy. Now, there's rumor on Rob being dedicated tonight. I'll give you all the major WWE vaccine students, the rumors, the headlines, the gossip, the speculation, all the updates. So, basically, all the script, basically, every time we're going down tonight. I'm giving you anything you need to know. So, WWE officials had talks this weekend about opening tonight's Rob from Los Angeles with a graphic dedicating the show to Barry Ogla Jr who tragically passed away after an entering answer with Ramsey Reddit at an indie wrestling event in Mexico on Friday night. Now, according to Reddit user Matt Spanfover, who has broke several WWE stories in the past year or so, the reports say that there was also strong talk between WWE producer Kevin Down Triple H and Vince McMahon. Apparently one of those three officials were in heavy favor of dedicating Rod to Barrow, but the other two were not. Now, it was not, specifi it was not specified which official was in favor of the dedication, so it's not yet known. So there was also reportedly discussion, discussion of bringing light to the situation because a former top WWE star was involved in the accident. Now, WWE officials are said to be sensitive to the idea of dedicating Rod to Barrow because they feel it may bring wrongful negative attention to Ram Stereo. Now, Rod being dedicated to Barrow Jr. should be taken as a rumor for now. It's, it was noted that Rod will, will likely end up airing without the dedication, but it has been a topic of discussion this weekend. So, also, now, it was also noted that... Did they, that that if they did go through with the dedication, it, it would just be in the form of a graphic at the start of the show, and all storylines would be kept as planned. So, yeah. Basically, there it is. Um, I don't know if there's anything else. I mean, obviously, I, I'm in school. If you didn't know, I'm a student. I'm in high school, 15, sophomore. Okay, let's see. Now there's also a spoiler photo for the second time tonight's Rob because uh you know also there's like a Roman Reigns and his family saying that he's only gonna do it for his family because he's just there's a photo. Oh, just to let you know, I just wanted to give you some you know addition. Sting and Roman Reigns are set for the Comic Con appearance in May, so Sting is still gonna be in May. So now the Rock, they're promoting the Rock's NFL game that's because he might be on Raw or doing WrestleMania or appearing on Raw or something like that, or even uh, or even like uh, he might be you know next to WrestleMania, so he might be doing as a favor. In it, so now there is backstage talk, ladies and gentlemen, on Barack Lesnar. I'm giving it to y'all. I'm giving you extra content. My videos are long, ladies and gentlemen. I dedicate it to you guys. Okay, so let's get into it. No, it's really short, to be honest. It's not really that long. But one of the hot topics among the WWE talents at this weekend's live events on the West Coast was the contract status of the WWE World Heavyweight Champion Brock Lesnar. Now, this is according to PW Insider. Now, everyone realizes that we're that we're to a point where Lesnar has to sign a deal a new deal or inform WWE that he's done after this coming weekend. Now, Lesnar's camp is reportedly playing their cards close to the list. And CM Punk is found earns in his garage because WWE's playing, you know, CM Punk with his live earnings. When he was traveling, you know, he'd do the, the angle at WrestleMania with the Undertaker a few years back and he tweeted saying, you know, on Twitter or something. This is the most pro. Oh, by the way, a post route update uh, reminder for tonight, if you didn't know, uh, it's going to be like uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger, uh, Triple H, Michael Wilson doing the interview between them and stuff. It's going to be after the, on the W Network when it goes up the air, by the way, if you didn't know. All about, you know, Kevin Ash, I think, is going to be going in the w, Tales of Team W Hall of Fame class induction, and Tom is going to be inducting him. So, yeah. So thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen. See you. Peace out. Thanks for the support and uh, make sure to like this video, share this video all over the entire internet on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitter. Comment with your thoughts and your opinions. And yeah, it's gonna be it. So uh, sub.
subscribe, ladies and gentlemen, subscribing viewers. The raw review will be will be a raw review. W raw three twenty three fifteen review will be tonight. Immediately following raw, so t stay tuned and stay live for that.